Hey y'all, let's do a cookie recipe today. I found this recipe. I like to give people their credit. It was on some blog called Me and My Three Sons or Me in the Kitchen with My Three Sons or something like that. And this is going to be a white chocolate cranberry pecan oatmeal cookie. That sounds like a lot, huh? <laughs> white chocolate cranberry pecan oatmeal cookie. So everything that I named is going to be in this cookie. So um, I think I didn't memorize the recipe in my head. So let's get started. So I got a cup and a half. Um, let me see. Let me place this down a little bit like that. A little bit like that. I got a cup and a half of all-purpose flour. <clears throat> so that's my dry. I'm about to put in there a, um, a, a teaspoon of cinnamon. See, it's so much easier when I have everything already measured out. A teaspoon of cinnamon. A teaspoon of... Um, baking soda and I'm about to put in a half a teaspoon of salt I can measure that with my hand that's about a half a teaspoon right there of salt I'm going to take my whisk and whisk up my dry like that so one cup and a half of flour one teaspoon of cinnamon, one teaspoon of baking soda, and a half a teaspoon of salt. All right, that's it for the dry. I'll be back with the wet. All right, to my mixing bowl, <clears throat> I have two sticks of butter. Can y'all see that? Two sticks of butter, softened butter that I had on um, room temperature. To that, I'm going to add a half a cup of white sugar, and one cup of brown sugar. All right. Get my mixer right here. About to cream this up. And I'll see y'all in a few minutes. All right. Let me show y'all right quick. Let me show y'all. Look at that. Put it down. Okay. See my butter and sugar whipped up. Can y'all see that? Yeah, y'all can see that. That's whipped up. Now, I'm about to add two eggs. Egg number one. No shells, baby. I don't do shells. Egg number two. That's it, baby. And I'm going to add my one tablespoon of vanilla abstract. I just pour it till I think it's a teaspoon. There we go. Never can have too much vanilla. All right. Now I'm about to mix this in, baby. Y'all can see the mixing. Can y'all see me? All right. Be right back. All right. Got all that good stuff creamed up. See it? Now, as it had our dry, which was that cup and a half of flour, that teaspoon of cinnamon, a teaspoon of baking soda and that half a teaspoon of salt. So we're gonna add that dry in there. I want it all in there. All right. After we mix this, y'all. Next step will be that. All right. All right. My cookie base is mixed. I say cookie base. Y'all know what I mean. All my ingredients mixed. Now, y'all know I have to do something childish. Well, not childish. Y'all know, hold up. Y'all know what I'm about to do. Y'all know what I'm about to do. Oh. <laughs> um. Mm. You remember when your mom used to make the cake? My mom would say, who wants the Beatles? And all your sister and brothers run for the damn beater. Now, mama know they only had two. How you gonna give? How you gonna give two beaters to six kids? <laughs> Wash my hand. Mmm, mmm. tastes good. That tastes good. All right. Got my 
hands wash and make sure I'm back in the camera. Yeah. All right. Now, all we have to do is, um, hold on, I have my beard. Now, all we have to do is just fold in. We don't need to mix anymore. I'm about to fold in three cups of, um, three cups of old-fashioned oats. Old-fashioned oatmeal. So, that's three cups of oats. I'm throwing in there. I'm about to put one cup of cranberries. See that? One cup of cranberries. Okay. One cup of white chocolate morsels. This could be a good cookie, y'all. And one cup of chopped pecans. Put that in there. I'm gonna take my wooden spoon. I'm about to stir this in. I'm to stir this in. Let me take my phone down so y'all can see me. Let your car so y'all can see me. See that? I'm about to just fold it in. And then I'm gonna put it in the fridge. See that? Then I'm gonna put it in the fridge and let this chill for a little while. All right, be right back. There go the cookie dough. Yeah, I know I like to work with firm dough, so I'm going to put mine in the refrigerator for about 10, 15 minutes so I can spoon it and put it on a sheet and we'll taste them, guys. That go to white chocolate, cranberry, pecan, oatmeal cookies. All right, let me let them chill. We're going to bake them on 350 between 10 and 12 minutes. Okay. All right, y'all. The dough has chilled. I'm going to put it down like this. It's firmed up. Y'all see it? It's good and firm. So, got me a tablespoon. I'm gonna get me a tablespoon full. My hands are ready to wash, y'all. Sometimes y'all be like, he ain't wash his hands. That would cause hell. We wash our hands before the camera come on. <laughs> get about that much right there. Roll it in a bowl. Throw in a bowl, smash it. These cookies don't spread out much because they're oatmeal and we only use one tablespoon. I'm sorry, one teaspoon of baking soda. So I'll put that one there. I'm gonna put about 12 to 15 on this pan. Okay. Piece, roll it in a ball. See, it's more easy to work with this way. You can do it with your hand. If you wanted to do it, as soon as you finish mixing it, you just drop it by the spoons. All right. These will be perfect round cookies. So, let me put them on the pan. I'll be right back, y'all. Okay, there we go. I got 15 of them on the tray. I'm going to let them bake between 10 and 12 minutes. I'm going to let y'all know the exact time I let them bake. All right. Let them go into the oven. All right. In the oven they go. There y'all go, cookie cookies. All right. All right, y'all. They've been in for about 10 minutes and a half. There they go. Be right back. Let me close the oven. All right, we're going to let these babies cool. I'm about to get my glass of milk ready, and we're about to eat them. Oh, they smell good, y'all. Oh, God, those cranberries smell good in there. All right, let's taste this cookie. It's my first time tasting this cookie, too, y'all. So we tasting it together. I'm going to pick this one right here in front of me. Oh, yeah. That's how I like my cookie. Look. Crispy on the outside, chewy in the middle. Now I pour me a glass of milk. Mmm. Oh. Mmm. 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 
Man, I'm just gonna be breakfast in the morning. Y'all, these cookies good. Cranberries, white chocolate, mm, pecans. Mm. Oatmeal. This is good, y'all. My first time making these. Seen this stuff on Facebook on Incredible Recipes. I decided to make them. Because I had all the ingredients in the house already. Mm. Oh, yeah. Make this for Thanksgiving, y'all. This is a good Thanksgiving. Or Christmas holiday cookie. Mmm, mmm. And make sure you get your glass of cold milk wet. All right, y'all. See y'all later. Now I'll make y'all some red velvet brownies tomorrow. Mmm. Bye. <laughs>